one step of three in terms of getting there at the Western Nationals, breaking the duck, as my Cohen has a touched on statistically here at this venue. Mark Drew showed ominous form in qualifying. But a tough rival in Chris Porter in this one. Oh, very dodgy reaction time for Drew, but he's just got the power and potency at the moment. 6.58, hello, contender in the building. Now we're getting back to some form. That is very quick. Low ET of the round so far of the two passes. No speed again. So he'll actually have lane choice over Chris Matheson in the semi-final when these two meet up. And again, look, he goes to the different option. Despite the fact that the front wheel's in the air, similar to Troy McLean, he decides to have the, the feet flailing around instead of steering it by having them on the pegs, each to their own. It's obviously working for him. Look at that. <laughs> See you later. Again, I just commented on the fact that no speed came up on the uh, timing screens here at the Perth Motorplex, and that is an issue in terms of there are points, incentives for those, and that looked like a tidy pass and a quick one. Yeah, well, to be honest, that could have had some big mile per hour on it. We'll never know. 